Good morning, Convy Patriots. Today is a terrific Tuesday, April 12th. Today is also Traveling Tuesday. Let us start it off with Miss Greco. You guessed where she was last week? Are you up to the challenge of seeing where she is this week? Here she can give you some clues on where she traveled this time. Take it away, Miss Greco. Hey Patriots, Miss Greco here for this next episode of Where in the World is Miss Greco. Last week I challenged you to figure out what country I was located in in North America, and many of you were able to guess that I was located in our great neighbors to the north, Canada. This week I am challenging you to find a country in Europe that I have traveled to. This country is in northeastern Europe. One third of this country is made up of forests and one fifth is made up of meadows. That means the environments and the animal species that you find here are very different depending on where you travel. Basketball is one of the most important and popular sports in this country. Several players from this country have gone on to play in the NBA. The national symbol in this country is a white knight on a horse with a sword, and it represents the struggles throughout history that this country has had. And lastly, because Easter is this weekend, Easter eggs in this country are not brought by an Easter bunny. Instead, they believe that a granny brings the eggs with help from a bunny, and the granny uses a sunbeam whip to drive a pony cart, and the pony cart helps the granny deliver eggs. Very different than the Easter bunny that we have. All right, let's recap your clues and see if you can figure out where I am. I'm in a country in Northeastern Europe. One third of the country has forests. One fifth of the country has meadows. Basketball is a very popular sport and there are famous NBA players from this country. The national symbol is a white knight on a horse with a sword and they believe that Easter eggs are delivered from a granny who gets help from a bunny and travels around on a pony cart. All right, Patriots, use your sources, internet, books, maybe you know an expert and figure out where I'm located. Don't forget to let me know where you think I am and where you'd like me to travel to next. Have a great day. Thanks, Miss Greco. All that traveling made me hungry. Let's see what the cafeteria is cooking up today. Today for lunch, we are having PD to go box, lead machine combo, fish nuts, goldfish crackers, vegetable and fruit choices are garden fried salad, baked beans, flavored raisins, applesauce, or juice. And don't forget your milk and utensils. That reminds me, today is National Grilled Cheese Day. Doesn't everyone like grilled cheese? I know I do. <laughs> it is birthday time. Happy birthday today to Saki in Miss Ferreira's class and for W in Miss Smith's class. Happy birthday. Tomorrow is early release. School gets out two hours earlier for students. School ends at 2.20. Sorry, teachers, you will have to stay at school. Girls on the Run team members. We have Girls on the Run today, not tomorrow because of early release. Patriots, it's that time. Time to sign up for the Pledge of Allegiance. Then, please be seated for a moment of silence. A terrific grilled cheese Tuesday, Patriots. We will see you back here tomorrow. And remember, we are living the questions by feeding our passions and exploring our wonders. Bye.